It's so good getting a chance to see you and talk to you. This is so much fun. So I'm gonna start off with George. How did it feel when Lopez versus Lopez got the green light for a second season? With Mayan being here, you really want to take her on a ride. The only way that her and I would ever experience anything like this. So, you know, my focus is on making sure that this show goes well into these years and that we get able to spend all this time together. And I mean, it's Lance and Mayan get along so well, Al, everybody found me and everything. So, you know, I've been through it with the first one and I see more, I mean, that show was great, but I see more strength here in everything top to bottom. And we're holding on tight to both of them. <laughs> Hold on tight. Al, what can we expect from Oscar this season? I mean, I have so much fun playing this part because they let me do voices constantly. I get to play an old timey switchboard operator. Yeah. <laughs> I love that voice. <laughs> Father, Father Ramirez. So they let me do all kinds of fun, silly stuff. You know, I'm a guy who has a waffle maker in the back of a truck. And he can pretend to, pretend to be high. What, what, who wouldn't, yeah. you, who wouldn't want to be that guy? Without giving too much away, what were some of your favorite shenanigans that you guys got into this season? This season, the shenanigans, I mean, my gosh. I have to say that it's really, there are moments where it's hard to keep a straight face, especially when we have big group scenes and, you know, everyone is doing their thing. George is famous for going, oh, I got something, I got something, you know, and we're like, oh, gosh. At least he gives us that warning of, like, something's coming. Yep. I just prepare myself by, like, you know, biting down on some corner of my mouth or just like thinking about something serious, but it's really impressive. It's really, I mean, 10 episodes and we are, we are delivering the yeah. goods.